much does it cost to replace a goalpost? Uh, that I don't know. Um, I'm going to go out on a, on a on the edge here and say thirty grand, F fifteen grand. Well, did they take both down? Well, they could have took both for thirty. <laughs> if somebody would have got it, other than the smart engineering students that that got it and supposedly cut it up into slices, you could have made enough money to fund NIL for two years by selling it to all the LSU people. Would be my guess. So you'll. You've talked about the support you've gotten right out here all year, and um, they hung in with they hung in with you a month ago or six weeks ago, and certainly made a difference Saturday, unquestionably. Cover that check if you have to, if you have to, fifteen grand for the gold post. Would you do that? Would I cover? Yeah. Uh, Since they're the ones that told me, think about that. <laughs> trying to think if I could use it as a tax write-off. <laughs> you know, it's funny. We were driving home. I thought about it a little bit, but. I don't think it, uh, anybody cares about covering on something like that. You know, the only issue you have with that is um, people send me the copies of videos from, I guess, Twitter, where, you know, the goalpost falls and hits people in the head. That, those are things that you worry about. The rest of it, the students, it's part of life. Let them have it, tear it down. Uh, I don't know how they got a stadium. They must have passed it in the stands and then passed it over a fence or something. Right, but but... But how did they get the big long piece out of the? They must have passed it up here and passed it over the fence back here or something. Well, I mean, you can't go through the tunnel with it. But anyway, you have a good time. You know, that's smart and have fun. It's part of a college experience, and so you know they were here. They got to be at the last bedlam and, and win and go celebrate and have fun. If what it would be to be young again and swim in a 63 degree uh, pond. Yeah. If you and I did that, uh, we might not get out. No. I'm not doing that no, I mean, I'm not doing it, but it's at that age, you know, they don't care. Probably had good insulation with uh, blood alcohol level. That'd be my guess. Had some Diet Cokes. In diet said. Cokes, good how, Diet Cokes. How long were you on the field? Um, not long. Um, after I talked to Coach Venables and did the TV, um, it's like we didn't even do the alma mater, right? I had no chance to do that. Um, so we, we started walking off, and I went over to thank the students. I, I had them walk me this direction to thank the students, and then I hit it and went to the tunnel. Not long. What did you say to Coach Venables? Do you mind sharing that? What did you say to Coach Venables? Oh, it's all personal.